Welcome to Wager Labs, I'm Matthew Alexander, and today we are going over five simple strategies to up your sports betting game. If you've been following our videos, you'll be familiar with a couple of these strategies, but uh, hey, we'll just start at number one, managing a bankroll. It's essential to create a unit size that's three to 5% of your entire bankroll. That is the number one most important rule in sports betting. Don't chase your bets. That's the surefire way to lose when it comes to sports betting. Number two, develop realistic expectations. There's plenty of people out there claiming they have 90% success rates. The best sports bettors in the world are hitting around 70%. So don't put pressure on yourself to hit any more than 55%. That's going to give you a great profit if you play the long game. Tip number three, keep a record of your bets and review them periodically. Now, I know this isn't the sexiest of tips, but when it comes to strategy and analyzing, if you have an algorithm, if you have a system, it's essential that you not only write down and track your picks, but review them as well. Number four, bet with your head, not with your heart. A lot of recreational sports bettors out there love to bet on sports, to make the game more thrilling when they're watching it on TV. Now, if you wanna be a recreational better, that's fine. But if you want to actually make money in sports betting, you must bet according to your system. And a lot of times, that means you're not gonna be able to watch that team. In fact, sometimes it takes the stress off if you don't watch. It makes it more enjoyable to just check your phone at the end of the day and see how much you've earned. Number five. Now this one, I don't necessarily subscribe to, but there are a lot of sharp sports bettors that do, so I'm gonna throw it out there anyways, which is bet on one sport only. Just like Warren Buffett says in the stock market, stick to what you're good at, stick to what you know. In sports betting, there are a lot of sharps that only bet in one particular sport. An alternative to this is to join a syndicate of sports bettors, which you can easily find online and find the sharps that specialize in the sports that you don't. Number five, do your research and talk to other sports bettors. Find a community. We live in the digital social age. Start finding people who share your common interest in sports bettings. Innovation happens in groups. So not only will you get accustomed to more lingo and better strategies, but you'll be able to exchange strategies and you'll be able to innovate new ones. Thanks for watching today's episode. Be sure to like and subscribe if you found value out of any of our videos and as always, I don't have an outro, so I always kind of just make it up. Uh, as always, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and look out for tomorrow's video. Good luck.